Hi, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to place a test order through Shopify without using the actual credit card using Shopify's uh, bogus gateway solution. Uh, so first of all, you have to be logged into your admin panel and then look for settings. Then click on payments. And then look for um, manage payments under Shopify and scroll all the way down and where you see it says switch to a third party provider then click on it click switch to third party provider leave page um, and then look for bogus bogus gateway for testing this one uh, make sure to enable it and but but beforehand you have to deactivate the shopify payments and for the reason other test and reactivate the bogus payment, uh, bogus gateway. So bogus gateway solution has been uh, activated. Now we can go ahead and place the test order through Shopify. So first of all, you have to go to your uh, homepage and then add a product to your cart and then go to checkout. Um, Let's uh, name Nick. Let's put some any address here because we're doing just a test order. Toronto. Continue with shipping. Uh, so let's choose uh, any. Uh, shipping method and here's going to be where we have to type in the credit card so this is the we see this b thing this is bogus gateway uh for the car, card number if you just put in one just just number one and um for the name on card just type in bogus gateway expiration it has to be any date in the future uh, right now it's may of 2022 let's just put december of 2022 and for security code a you have to put in any three digit number it could be one two three or one 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 anything let's just put one two three uh same as shipping and pay now the the order has to go through Excellent, the order has been uh, complete. Now let's go to the Shopify admin panel. Let's go to orders. And here it is. This is the order we just placed. And it has been placed through payment gateway. So it's not real order. So you can just look around, see how the order confirmation went through and, and whatever. And uh, then you can just go ahead. If you want, just you can cancel the order. Uh, cancel order and yeah cancel so that's how you place a test order through shopify and now once you're already and happy you can just go ahead and re-enable the shopify payments let's go to settings payments and switch to shopify payments activate Yeah, so basically right now Shopify payments is practically activated. So I hope you found this video useful. And if you want to learn more about Shopify, please ensure to subscribe to my channel. Thank you.